Today we'll be surviving 100 days in Minecraft's hardcore super flat. Except there's one big change. Instead of grass, the floor is made of nothing but lava. Now over this time, we have three goals. Get a full set of netherite items, defeat the wither, and acquire a master level villager of every single trade. We're also getting really close to 1 million subscribers, so please sub to help us out, and let's do this. Ah! <laughs> oh my god, I gotta act fast. Oh my god, everything's already on fire. We have to get the wood before it burns. Okay, oh, oh, I know what we'll do. Release the water, yes. Come on, get the food. Crafting table. Okay, there's our axe. We need all, we need all the wood we can get. This is insanity. <laughs> okay, that should be enough. Now, iron golem. I really don't want to do this, but I have to. We need iron. If we don't get iron, I think this run is probably already over. So, ah! Ah, ah, ah. you're not going to hit me, right? Because I am one shot. Okay, we're good. Yes. Oh, five. Yes. Oh my God. Okay. Oh God, this is so dangerous. Buckets. And there we have it. Water. We can make this safe. That's a lot better. Okay, let's grab the rest of this wood. Huh, okay. Not a bad start, actually. Now, I don't know if hay burns, but I don't really want to find out. <gasps> you poor pig. Come here, buddy. It's gonna be okay. Okay, let's make a pickaxe. Oh man, I, oh, wait. Right, use the water. Ha ha! All right, there's the cobble pick. And let's make this all just a little bit safer. Oh, this is phenomenal. We're half a day in and I'm still alive. All right, there's a shovel, axe, and pick. And hope. Oh, now we gotta place a few torches down just so that we don't have any mob spawning. Not really in a place to be getting in fights yet. And I think we're gonna spend the rest of the day just getting as many resources as we can. <gasps> oh! Actually, that is a priority. There we go, 24 pieces of bread. At least now we have a little bit of safety. Let's grab ourselves a bed and get mining. Ah! Oh, okay, first scare with fire. Well, there's the end of day zero. A little bit more wood up here. And uh, I guess I'll take some terracotta. I mean, you know how the old saying goes. A little terracotta never hurt nobody. <gasps> Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. How, where did you come from? Oh, 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 this is bad. How are you spawning? It's completely bright. Oh, we got spiders too? Ha! Ha, ha, ha! Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, this is, no, 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 no. Oh, 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 juke, jive, dodge. Oh, oh, I wish I had an higher golem now. Oh my God. Oh, this is safe. Oh, it's not safe. It's not safe. It's not safe. Oh, 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 oh my God. Heal, my friend. Chicken, you got to get out of here, buddy. Okay, I think we're good. Oh, a chest. We got saplings. One more bread. Ah, so that's where everything spawned, huh? <laughs> we already have a zombie villager, of course. Wow, I'm really sorry, but uh, not really in a position to be curing you right now. And there goes our axe. Oh, I forgot about slimes. Well, I suppose we can start tearing apart this house. At this point, I feel like literally every block is a precious resource. <laughs> God, it's so horrible. Well, it ain't much, but it's an honest living. I wonder if there's a way we could keep these pigs from getting burnt up. Yeah, maybe if you go in there. Maybe, yeah, if I get carrots, you guys will all come on in, right? Ah! 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 Oh, let's try that again. <laughs> okay, I just want to make sure that these guys can actually survive in here. Okay, so now if we cover this in, we should be okay. Now, come on, my dudes. Perfect. You guys stay there. Maybe if I if I do this, you'll stay. Oh, 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 food. Yes, just gonna take it all. Oh no, no, no! Ah! Oh, I'm so sorry, chickens. I, I killed you. Okay, at the very least, maybe we can get one sheep. Oh no. Well, I guess it's time for a fight. What's up? Ha ha! Oh, I love the lava. All right, Mr. Sheep, please follow me. Excellent, there you go. Now, you guys stay here. I will return maybe someday. Oh, halfway through the day. I swear I saw a village distance but maybe really did i not oh there's one. Oh, there's one uh and there's one i think i see a cleric's one there ah uh, but that one's closer yeah we gotta go this way so if we don't make it by the end of the night we're dead the worst part is is because i can see it it's now technically spawned in and so that means it's already 
on fire. Oh no, we have slime. There's one thing I am grateful for. It's that these slime are incredibly stupid. I think their AI looks at the lava mechanic like it's just regular ground, which I, I really don't mind at all. It makes me happy. Wow, that was really good timing. And as I said, the entire village is already on fire. Okay, now we are going to patch this up so no one can come through. Oh my God. <laughs> Okay, 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 this is bad. We need the wood. All right, let's just take all these seeds. And I actually want the dirt too. I mean, how else are we gonna start our own farm? All right, let's, uh, let's check out what's in this village. Cows! Okay, we have safe cows, and we have safe pigs. On the bright side, we've definitely got some nearby villages. <gasps> Iron Golem. So once again, this is unbelievably risky, but we gotta do it. Oh, don't get caught on fire, don't kill me. Yes! Oh, three more iron. Oh, is this a blacksmith? Oh, it is. Oh my God, this could be huge. <gasps> Dude, let's go. Not just one, but two pairs of boots, leggings. Oh my God. And of course, two iron pigs. That's like two iron golems. What else have we got? Please. Eh, well, saplings are nice. Also have a perfectly intact house, first of all, and some emeralds, saplings, bread, not bad at all. Now let's do a little bit more harvesting. Dude, look at that trail of death over there. We live to see another day. So that's where we came from. I think I wanna head to this village actually. That way we can sort of get like a little triangle going. Uh, I should have enough time. Oh, and would you look at that? Nothing but gloom, doom, and death. Oh, I'm so sorry, village. Everywhere I go, I bring death and destruction. Okay, what have we got here? Burning villagers. Apples? That's actually huge. More bread. Oh, we needed a book. I need iron. Ho, oh, oh. Oh, that was risky, but we got 10 iron. So for now, I guess we'll just spend the rest of the night getting cobblestone. Okay, I just need to make sure I've got this right. So we have this spot, ah, this spot here, and then that one, okay. So I think it would be cool if what we did is actually connect all three locations. Now, nah, it's not really crucial that I finish this one just yet, but we're getting an idea of going, of sort of kind of like land bridges connecting each village. Now, it doesn't really matter at all, but I think we're gonna make our house somewhere in this area because there's two villages over there. Oh, there's another village, nice. Now, I actually don't see anything burning from this distance, so maybe we'll just start here. Basically, I'm just gonna make this a giant area. I want it to be big enough so that I can't hear the lava on any side, but not so big that I can't torch it up and we get a million monsters. That's not bad. That's gotta be enough, right? Oh my God, silence for the first time. Wow, I like this. All right, so first things first, torches just everywhere. Because there's no areas for mobs to spawn, they'll literally take whatever they can get. And so that's why we saw that land bridge with 18 million mobs. Now you'd think the lava would do a pretty good job of, you know, keeping it safe, but surprisingly it, it never really does. I think that should be good. Make a wall. Wow, this is actually kind of cool. It's not gonna be much, but let's get this house underway. And here's our lovely house. The bright side, we got no mob spawning here. So this might be the stupidest play ever, but I think I'll actually take this all down. And then maybe we can make, yeah, some cobblestone walls. <laughs> sure, yeah, that, that works. Okay, we need more cobblestone. We're gonna try the thing. I hope this works. Ah, uh, dang it, okay. So we wanna do it like this. Yes, and now I think we just mine. Oh no, the water's too fast. Now surely. Yes, amazing. I'm gonna do this for a few minutes. All right, amazing. Hey, buddy. That's right, follow me. Just a little further. Amazing! Sticks and arrows. So I could actually buy arrows from this guy, and I could also sell him sticks, which is very expensive, but I will do it. Now, if I fill up on arrows, you'll level up, right? And then we can buy a bow. Okay, sell you some more sticks. 
And ladies and gentlemen, just like that! Oh, you're awesome! Thank you. Okay, now we should probably also make some doors. As the old saying goes, doors are good for your health. So, with our newfound friend, I think we should probably start planting some trees. Now, there is something else I kind of want to try. It's incredibly dangerous, but if it works, we're just all around going to be in a much better place. Oh, hi there. I'm so glad I made a bow. Oh my God. Oh, ah! wow, that is a safety hazard. There's monsters. What? Ah, all my torches went off. That's probably how. That is one nether portal. Oh, wait. Uh, oh, I'm going to have to break this. One moment. A few moments later. Okay, so now we just place this in here, take something flammable and cover it. Oh my god, that w what? Dude, that usually takes like five minutes. Okay, let's make a shield. Man, it's so risky. I think we have to use our iron. I hate it, but going into the nether, hardcore, yeah. I mean, that feels a lot better, but I, I would really like some more wood and, and maybe some gold, so... Here we go! I come in peace! Oh, I don't like that. No gold, huh? Okay, bone blocks. That's huge. Now, this is really what I came here for. We need 64. Oh, yes! Yes! <laughs> yeah, that was definitely planned. Oh, this might be enough. 53. <laughs> He's just standing there, menacingly. Okay, we're just gonna safely scale a cliff. Oh, this looks promising. Yes, come on. Okay, that's enough. Let's get out of here. We're alive. Perhaps for now, we'll just cover that up. What's up, dude? I'm alive. I'm actually better than alive. Because as you may have noticed, I have a golden apple. So now I feel like we've got our plan B. You know, if everything goes wrong, we've always got our backup golden apple. The other thing we got is bone block. That is a lot of bone meal. So we'll go ahead and start a little farm. We'll do some carrots and some wheat. And then I think we literally just bone meal the crap out of everything. Ha ha! And then with our last gold nugget, we make a golden carrot and replant everything. Oh, so obviously when it's raining, nothing can get set on fire, which means if we go to this village, it'll be safe. The problem is that obviously it's nighttime. So if we take our charcoal, we're just going to have to hope that 46 torches is enough to make it because this is truly an opportunity we might not get again. Here we go. Wait, no, why is it on fire? Whoa! Oh, it's so cool. There's a blacksmith. Wow, that was perfect. Hello, village. What have we got? Actually, I'm going to take all the beds. Cartography table. Well, emeralds are always appreciated. Dude, this is so cool. Okay, the big reveal. What have we got? Helmets. Oh, and a smithing table. All right, I think we got to go for the next one. This time, it's just going to be a YOLO run. Oh, this is really dangerous. This is not so good. Oh, oh, son. Yes. Well, that... It's not good, but also good, I guess. It has its ups and downs. The sad thing is this village is pretty much already gone. <gasps> a horse! A horse! We gotta save him! Okay, you're good, dude. <gasps> Siren Golem is gonna die. All right, I think we'll just go for it. Yes! That's three more iron. Look at these dudes, just snoozing. Ah, uh, I gotta fight you too. Sorry, man. Come fight me. Actually, this is, this is fine. No! Oh, rip. Okay, I think that's everything. Not a whole lot here. <gasps> but another golem. Yeah, come fight me. Oh, 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 you can. Hey, hey, yeah. Yeah, go do him. Go do him. Thanks. Now I gotta do you. Yes! Amazing! Only seems right to go hit this last one. Also, there's a lot of mobs spawned here, so this might not be so bad. Wait, what? Actually, question. What is down here? Bedrock. <gasps> what if? Wait, but how would I get back up? Because then it's just gonna be lava. Yeah. Okay, not yet, but that's a question for another time. Oh. Well, this doesn't look promising. Ah, we got apples. And bread. Oh, wow, this is a trash village. I'm not even sad that it's on fire. Ho, 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 ho. I'm on fire. At least we have an iron golem. Excellent. 11 iron. There's one thing we do need. Another bucket of water. Anyway, let's head on back. And there it is. Home sweet home. Check out this map. <laughs> wow. 
What a beautiful map. <laughs> I bet you've never seen a map like this before. <laughs> Infinite water. Okay, now I want to come back to this whole dirt thing. If we just dig straight down, we get bedrock. This is the floor of the world. And we basically just have like unlimited dirt. So I suppose if we wanted to, we could just dig under our house completely. So that's kind of cool. Now, honestly, I'm, I'm really already sick of this obsidian. So why don't we go ahead and just make it dirt? Dude, I'm already getting desert flashbacks. Guys, I've actually got a theory that I need to test. You see this grass? Well, I wonder, would it be possible to transport the grass to my house in a straight line? Now all we can do is hope. Now we return to the dirt. I don't know, man, I'm digging out Y1, but it's like I just can't find any diamonds. We're obviously not done, but uh, that was a pretty good start. Now, I think it's time we go get some more villagers. Fortunately, we have this beautifully constructed, super safe, not dangerous highway. So, is anyone still alive? Nope. No. No. Oh, man. Guess I didn't think this one through, huh? Okay, this is still gonna be dangerous. Well, here we go. Ready for the world's biggest juke? <laughs> Ho, ho! Bro, you gotta love the super highway. Now, I really feel like someone's gonna be alive here. No, no! I'm gonna uh, actually be taking this. Sorry, sir. So you're gonna be coming with me. All right, lads, now begins the long journey. I think this is the best way to transport multiple villagers. In the day, you use the workstations, and at night, you use the beds. Now, if you guys could just not catch on fire. All right, I think we're at the clear. Oh, no, they want to go to bed. No, 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 no. You sure you guys don't want to just sleep here? Oh, God, this is dangerous. Okay, well, that is clearly not working. So, boat technique it is. Here we go. Villager, I release you of your binds. <gasps> you wouldn't. You jerk. You're not getting out. This is your home now, bro. Anyway, let's go check on our other guy. Will you follow me? Yes, you will. You absolute legend. All right, the final step, bro. You're almost there. Yes, over the wall. Over the wall. You got this. And they're both going to bed. Huh, maybe he just missed his friend. Sharpness, unbreaking, and knockback for seven. That's, that's pretty good. And a guy that sells boots. Perfect. Now let's go ahead and get ourselves some trees. And let's make some sticks. Let's sell some sticks. And hey, check it out. We got a decent sword. Oh, and let's start handing out some bread. How's our grass coming along? Apparently not well. Well, I'll tell you what. We'll make this a little bit wider. And hey, look at that. We got a baby. And here's our grass update. Ah, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, what's up now? And I got my enchanted iron sword. You're not so tough. Gonna run all over you. Yeah, I gotta jump on you. I just really want this grass to move faster. Oh my god, I forgot to torch that side. Oh my god. I just messed up so bad. I have never messed up so bad in my life. My villagers are turned. Oh dear god. Oh dear god. Get back, bro. Oh, 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 oh. The knockback. Oh, oh, oh. Yes. Okay. Okay, now we just gotta cover that up. Oh no. Oh no. Golden carrot. Yes. Oh, 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 I got a bail. I got a bail. Oh, oh, what have I done? My island has been overtaken. My villagers turned. Oh, no. Oh, that's really bad. Yes. Oh, my God. Oh, 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 oh. Yes. 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 I don't even have a bed. I mean, I can't even sleep this off. There's a bed in here. Oh yeah, that's right. You're all gonna burn, all of you. What an absolute nightmare. We even have villagers now. Oh, of course there's a guy in here. Oh no, 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 no. Cool off. Okay, we, we magically just lost one. Actually two, now that I think of it. If there's a lesson we've learned today, it's always put down torches. Oh, that was really close, man. What are we gonna do with you guys? Seeing as I don't have a golden apple glass brewing stand, blaze powder, or fermented spider eye, or sugar, I don't really think that this is gonna work. So for now, my dear friends, I'll even give you some water. Cows? Have I just been blind? Have there always been cows? What? I promise I'm not hacking? I don't understand. This is the greatest day ever. Got a great spot over here. You're gonna love it. Oh yeah, isn't that awesome? Tell you what, have some wheat. 
Make some babies. So now for the most important question. Have we put enough torches down? It would seem so. So I think we need to take some time and just slow things down a little bit. We've had some close calls and we're hardly even set up. So let's just take it back to some relaxing OG Minecraft type stuff. Like, uh, you know, farming. Yeah, we'll do all kinds of farming. Whoa. Hey. Anyway, I think if we just break like... Like that block, maybe? Oh, no. Oh, I did the wrong block. It's this one. Excellent. Wow. That couldn't have worked better. You won't kill them, right? Uh, it's not really a risk we can afford to take. Oh, God. We in the Thunderdome, baby! Yes. Okay, so you guys will not burn. So you, sh you should be good. Oh, look at that. The 4x4 four four oak grass update. Oh, we'll just uh, get moving on this. And then we can start breaking this stuff. Excellent. Ah, no. My garden. <laughs> How dare you? How dare you? Oh, I hate slime. I will beat you with a stick. Oh, let's try this again. Let's make a fence. Hopefully this will be enough. Oh god, no, no, no! I hate lava superfly! No, 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 no! Oh my god, no, no. Go away! Bro, I'm out here literally just trying to live my life. Go away. Yes, fight, you losers. Ha! Let's feed some cows. Finally, we can get back to planting trees. Hey! That's a big tree. I need more wheat. Take all the wheat. Yo, grass update? Not bad. You know, I really can't help but shake the feeling that we're gonna need some real villagers. So let's go on a little adventure. <gasps> Oh, get juked. Get smacked. Oh, this does not look good. I saw movement. Oh my God, right. Also, what? <gasps> there are five of you? I can't believe it. Oh, and another guy. Poor man. So let's do a little demolition and maybe we can get them to come to us. I don't, I don't really know. And I'm gonna say odds of survival. Pretty low. So the only other thing I can really think of is if we dig down. I think this might be the way. Oh, that's lava. This is either the worst or best idea I've ever come up with. Oh, I just realized you can't place boats down. Well, this idea is now ruined. <laughs> but on the bright side, at least we tried, right? <gasps> it's a witch! Oh my god! We need witch. We need a dead witch is what we need. Yeah, come on. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, you can die. Yes, but no! Well, actually, that that's good, I guess. Uh, as long as I don't die. Yeah. Dang, so we need sugar. That's not sugar. Anyway, good morning, everybody. Well, there's gonna be a lucky two of you that get to become villagers, I guess. Who wants a job? <laughs> Slow but steady. Oh, there we go. Oh, this is gonna be a problem. I don't know why this wasn't a problem previously. Why were there no slimes last time we tried this? Well, on the bright side, they, they can't kill villagers. Yeah, get in the fire, bro. Get in the fire, dog. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Oh, oh. <gasps> You idiot! No! Oh, I'm so stupid! Why am I so stupid? I. Ah! Villagers! The greatest and worst aspect of Minecraft. Go to, uh, to bed. Oh, and would you look at that? The other guy's gone. I hate villagers! Wait, now you're coming back. Because you're not an idiot. That is one live villager. All right, my dude, this is it. Yes, welcome home. These gentlemen, there it is. Why do I hear a baby zombie down here? Oh, what? I don't think these chickens actually breed or like stay, which is really sad, actually. Really sad. But maybe if I give it some seed, it'll, it'll stick around. Probably not. And I don't think they breed. Grass update. Anyway, it's uh, time to do that all over again. So who wants to take place in the most excruciating walk ever. You both do. All right, guys, we're gonna make this quick and clean this time. You hear me? Quick and clean. Now, bed up for grabs. Yes! Now, please just go to bed. We did it. <gasps> we even have a Fletcher with the wrong deals, but it's a Fletcher. So, who wants to be a Fletcher? Excellent. Now, let's bring that big stick energy. You, my sir, my good man. Once again, we return to the stick hustle. Now, who wants to become a farmer? Beetroot and emerald. 
I will take that. Because now we actually have a source of food. Let's make these beetroots large and in charge. Oh my god, dude. The amount of time it's going to take to get emeralds from beetroots. I don't know. But on the bright side, we do have sticks. Ladies and gentlemen, we interrupt the current programming to bring you this exciting announcement. Grass has hit the main island. Very soon, things will be looking much more aesthetic around here. And this won't surprise you, we also got more sticks. Which is more emeralds. But now, everything changes. Because we've been collected all these emeralds. We've got our work tables. So who wants it? We should, yeah, we get an armor. Now we'll just buy a bunch of iron boots. Don't tell him about this. He levels up and <laughs> the chainmail boots. Pretty sure we can smelt these. <laughs> yeah, we can for one whole iron nugget. They don't even stack. All that for a drop of iron. Oh, my man's got helmets. And now I'm breaking in projectile protection and feather falling. Ladies and gentlemen, diamond armor, couple shields, my mans. What have you got for me? Blast protection three and unbreaking, and unbreaking two. I'll take it. You see this? You see this right here? It's going in the trash. I'm sick of this stupid iron armor on like day 20. We are upgrading, ladies and gentlemen. There it is. The slightly enchanted diamond armor. Took five days. I think it was worth the grind. Now, as sad as it is, I'm actually gonna smelt the rest of this chain mail because we just don't have a reliable source of iron. Oh, wait a second. Hey there, Dudley. Aha, five more iron. But wait, we're not done yet. We got this, uh, what do we got? Looting one in sharpness. Yeah, that, that works. Oh, so now we buy iron axes, which is actually like a positive upgrade that's gonna help us. And there we go, level up. Oh, uh, now nah, he's gonna do the bell thing, though. We could sell him iron. <laughs> could just keep killing iron golems. Oh, oh, but he can come to me and kill me. Oh, God. Oh, God. Uh, bro, we got Brutus. Okay, five more iron. Okay, so if I sell all my iron, not quite enough. However, I buy a bunch of chainmail helmets. Spend the night <laughs> turning them into iron nuggets. <laughs> Give me your boots, too. Okay, not bad. Now, my dude. Please take this humble piece of iron. What do you got for me? Flint? Okay, and uh, this is the part where we cry. Hey, on the right side, we have a toolsmith. Why don't we talk to this guy? Ha <laughs> ha, a man of many hoes. I cast your hoes into the fire. Oh, and would you look at that, another bell guy. Well, this iron ain't gonna make itself. What? Oh, where? How? Maybe we'll bring them kind of close, and that way get some more golem spawning, maybe. Oh, you get out of here, buddy. Wow. Wow, did anyone see that arrow? <laughs> I almost domed my mans. Dude, I don't understand. How many torches does one island need? Oh, 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 that's where they're getting in. Nice try, nerd. It's a little further. Yes. Yes. Nice. We got everyone in here. Get some more fuel. Oh, my God. It's like... 0.2 seconds faster, but it just feels so good. Stone tools, man. I don't recommend. Please subscribe if you respect my past suffering. Now we can do it twice as fast. Wow, that was almost not tedious. You know, if we just let this one zombie through, well, what could go wrong? We'll just bring this guy in here. Everyone's gonna freak out, but give it a sec, okay? Where are the iron golems at? <laughs> I don't know. Is it dead? And hey, there's a dude. Oh, poor guy. All right, let's go for it. No, <laughs> we're so close. Can I smell axes? Oh, I can. I can smelt axes. There's four and three. Ha ha. Now, my dude, please, please be cool. A fortune one pickaxe. Not that fortune helps, but it's an iron pickaxe. Yes. Thank you. Oh, I know it might not seem like a huge deal to you guys, but stone pickaxes. They're worse than stone axes. Watch this. <gasps> it's marginally faster. Anyway, that's all good, but we're really not gonna make any more progress until we get more, more emeralds. So we're back to the tree hustle. Also grass update. Hey, where'd you come from? Uh, I'll just go with the iron picks. Cause at least they're iron picks. We'll do the rest of the way in an iron hose, maybe. No, that was a huge failure. Okay, my last 18. One more. And now, diamond tools. Let's go. Okay, there it is. 20 emeralds for the efficiency one. Unbreaking one. Diamond axe. Iron axe, you were so lovely. But look at that. First diamond tool. 
<gasps> whoa, 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 whoa. I just saw a llama. Screw you. <gasps> oh my god. Hello. What have you got for me? Dark oak sapling. Dude. Ice spikes energy with our last five emeralds. You madman. I guess we can just plant that right there. And uh, I'm gonna get chopping. Oh, it's so fast. Our first Master Fletcher with really bad... Okay, never mind. Now, you, sir, give me the dark oaklings. Wait, oak saplings, whatever. Wow, this is so exciting. Ladies and gentlemen, here it is, the start of something truly special. By the way, I should also mention, Ice Spikes is not actually over. There's a 100 days episode coming... <laughs> Someday. <laughs> I think I'll also go ahead and buy some blue orchids. What can I say? Big flower guy. And there we have it. A couple oak saplings. Sadly, not four. Let's just say we were to take this zombie. Oh. Well, that actually, uh, okay. This is really not something I love doing in hardcore, especially with I don't have full health. Man, do I love iron. Five whole pieces. Oh, <gasps> what? A Bro, in a enchanted diamond zombie villager? Oh, and he's he's dead. There is nothing we can do. Wow, look at that health though. RIP to a real one. Anyway, very quickly. I want you to Yep, there you go. Nice. And then Oh, 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 come on. No, no, no. No, no, no. Yes. Okay. What is happening? The cows. The cows. How is water flowing through? What's... Bro, did I somehow make infinite water? Yes, I did. Well, on the right side, we got some steak and another golem. So with that, we can make two hoppers. Okay. So we just weed it up. Uh, I think we got it. Okay, we got cows in there. So then, I think we put the water like there. Put one thing there. There we go. So now we just gotta feed the cows and let this become ridiculous. <gasps> I just had an even better idea. We replace the chest with a furnace. And then, <gasps> yes. So theoretically, if this square were to reach the max number of mobs per square, uh, it would turn to mush and then steak would fall in there and into the hopper like that maybe drop it in and there it is uh we need this to be higher dang it i will work this bottom up chest hopper furnace hopper yep uh, uh, come on yes <laughs> this is excruciating get in the hole yes please cow yes yes uh, who else wants to get up here <laughs> Yes! Oh, this might be easy now that there's so many. Also, let's start feeding them. Ha ha! Drop on down with your friends. Ha! Ah, this is working! Bro, this is this is the most madman thing I've done. Pushing cows into a one-by-one -one square in a thunderstorm. We are probably gonna get struck by lightning. Oh no. Ho! Oh, oh, ho! What? What? No! 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 Yes, okay, we got our two, three, four. I'm just gonna bop some some guys off because it's so it's so crowded Come on. yes just gonna cut my losses and be happy with this absolute sadness give them some wheat so if i fill this up and then drop my beef in it's gonna cook <gasps> and there it is automatic steak and check it out 17 steak grass update anyway now that we got a few more emeralds i think i would like to finally buy a shovel and some more iron picks Maybe? No, shovels, actually. And iron picks. There's the level up, and there it is. The efficiency two diamond pick. I'm going to head to the nether. Ah, hey, cut it out. <gasps> the sniper. Listen, man, literally just here for bones. <gasps> this poor lava. Hey, let's bone meal this guy. What? What? Oh, I'm so stupid. This is dark oak. What if we try it like this? That easy. See, I don't love this because it doesn't really yield a whole lot of stuff. Also, I can't believe I just wasted all that bone meal. Not quite as good as spruce, but probably the second best. But at the end of the day, <laughs> it's all just a bunch of sticks. Did I say sticks? I meant emeralds. Ladies and gentlemen, there you have it. The diamond pickaxe. Look at that. So the next thing I want to do is try to make an iron farm. I spent the last day acquiring materials. And so now it is time. 
So because this is super flat, we're actually limited on a lot of items. But I think I managed to come up with something that's actually going to work. So the first layer is going to look something like this. And then I'm going to place these three looms with buttons on top and the three beds for our villagers. Next, we fill in the walls. We are actually going to let my mans out. Haha! -ha! That was so easy. Yes. I'll just make a bit more wall. And so they should only have one way to go. Now for the scary part, please don't fall. Tremendous. We'll then put a chest right here. And you should really just go to sleep, bud. Excellent. All right, that's the villager side sorted. Cover this over. And oh my God, a zombie. That is so perfect. Bro, how did you know? Oh, that is not good. That is not good. That is not good. Ha! 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 Oh, 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 oh. Wow. Ha, 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 ha. Okay, let's try this again. I want you to fall in here. Okay. Ha ha. You fool. Okay, so now they're going to be all panicked. That's great. All right, there we go. So once the baby turns into an adult, all conditions should be met for an iron golem to spawn, which takes us to our next floor. Now, we don't have them yet, but the hoppers would go here. We then place a sign here, here, here. The lava goes there. More walls. Water goes there. We need to line the sides with signs. Otherwise, the iron golem gets stuck in the walls. And as you can see, it's a slow decline into uh, <clears throat> fun. Oh, hey, we are actually going to fight. Aha. Hey, there's our hopper. Yes! Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> this is a perpetual suffering machine. Ah, uh, yes, yeah, so we need more hoppers. Well, apart from iron, there's still obviously one huge problem here. Th this. Wait, my zombie died. How did, did you kill him? That's fine, because I'll just kill you. Aha! So, cover this off. But obviously, iron golems are still going to be able to spawn up top here. That's where the lava comes in. No iron golems will spawn on top of here now. Our super, super safe collection system. So I'm stuck. God, where's the stepbrother when you need him? Dude, I hate lava. Ha-ha! Perhaps this is a way out. What? Are you kidding me? Oh my god! Okay, change of plants. <laughs> <laughs> this is so ridiculous. We will be using the incredibly complex ladder system. Perfect. Look how easy that was. Ten iron, which is precisely two more hoppers. So there, there, and there. If I then drop some things in, goes on through. Tremendous. <gasps> we got a zombie with an arrow. You're my guy. Come on through, bro. Follow me, sir. Now, I still don't think this zombie is going to last forever. For that, we would need a name tag. Ah, wow, that was so easy. Place some water there. And so in theory, this should now start making golems go in there, unless they go here. <laughs> oh, and they are all adults now, perfect. Uh, see that? Yeah, that's gonna happen. In a regular game, what you do is just place glass, but we don't have access to sand. Hey, there we go. This is so sad and, and dark, but yes, iron. Well, it's not very fast. Oh, that explains it. You dingus. Yeah, stop spawning down here. If that's going to be a problem. What we're going to have to do is make it super dangerous. So we actually want this lava to come in. Because this way, iron golems can't spawn here. And then we just have to walk this entirely safe tightrope. And this is more iron than we've had the entire game. So I'm really not mad. Okay, well, this should be enough. <gasps> I saw that one. There it is. We got it. <laughs> this is so ridiculous. But at the end of the day... Whatever works. Zombie's still alive. Iron golems go in. A super safe walkway. And boom, boom. Wow. Look, it may have taken the better half of four days, but gosh dang it, am I glad it works. But now that we got all this iron, the question is, what do we do with it? Uh, honestly, I, I, I'm good, man. I, I don't even really need iron. I just needed it for the hoppers for the iron farm. Now, with all that done, I'm feeling like we are a little bit more established. Tree stuff, iron, automatic cow farm, maybe. Not really sure how this is going. Oh, there is steak, but the leather, right. Either way, I uh, think it might be time to finally start making some aesthetic upgrades. So for the next few days, I will do nothing but acquire cobblestone and dirt. Three days later. Okay, we've got the cobblestone and the iron stuff. Now we take our furnaces, add hoppers, chests, and load this bad boy up. Now we just need to find a fuel source. 
And just like that, we've got our very own stone maker. And now while we wait for all this to finish, I'm gonna take some time and we're gonna chop some more wood. Okay, it's time for an aesthetic upgrade. I've never done this before, but I kind of want to try chiseled stone bricks. And of course, some classic stone bricks. Farewell, cobblestone. Wow, incredible. We will replace a couple stone slabs. And now let's start on these walls. This layer is going to be stone brick, as well as these other two. Hmm. Okay, I don't know how, but I think we lost a villager. That seems so um, impossible. Well, he was a trash farmer anyway. He never made me anything. Oh my God, I hate villagers. You're so annoying. I hate all of you. I hope that zombies get in right now. You know what? I hope that the ender dragon itself spawns in on your dumb faces and kills all of you. I don't need your stupid trades. I hate you. You're gonna die. Get down from there. You are a child. Ah! Here, take these stupid beds. You have your stupid babies. No, 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 no. Oh, come on, get in the hole. Yes! Ha, ha And we got a baby. Now, back to the house construction. And then slabs on top. Bottom floor done. Now, I got a fun idea for stairs. Yes. Beautiful. That's actually kind of nice. It's time to finally tear this down. Amazing. And now we second floor it. Amazing. Excuse me? Bro, and, and, and what were you doing? Gosh, where did that zombie come from? <laughs> Here is our brand new monstrosity. Now I need more wheat so I can get more bread so that I can make more villagers. So let's sell off some of this wood. Oh my God, that's only one stack. Now my good man, let me buy all your shears. <gasps> Which? Oh, uh, where's my bow? Why don't I have a bow? No time, someone sell me a bow. Come on, still there. You just wanna slowly walk over here, sir. Oh, redstone. There's another one. Here we go. Keep coming. Oh, get away from that lava, though. Ah, uh, no sugar. Dang, man, it's so rare. Now, I would love to buy your carpet. So the use for carpet is pretty simple. I don't want slime spawning up here. And slimes can't spawn on carpet. Well, I think if we want to make any progress, we're gonna have to return to the tree hustle. Chopping trees intensifies. Oh boy, I can't wait to be disappointed by my profits. Thank you, sirs. All right, that is my entire supply. Yeah, this definitely is a desert. Anyway, the next thing I actually want to do is move everything upstairs and finally make a legit storage system. And we can even label everything with item frames. Ha! Ah, I feel like I can breathe. Organization. Oh, hey, a bucket of tropical fish. Oh, and melon seeds. Nice. Oh, wow. I haven't felt this calm in a while. Now, can buy some more beds. Let's get ourselves nice and organized. It feels so good. Oh my God. Why did I wait this long? Wow. Now, actually, let's go full organization. I'm talking nothing but gray beds. Oh, it makes me so happy. Now, let's go check on our iron. <gasps> what? Oh my God. Dude, how? 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 It's the middle of the day. Oh my God. All right, you know what? I didn't love this guy's trades anyways. Sorry, baby. There we go. Oh, dude, because I don't have torches down? Are you serious? Bro, Lava Super Flat is the most deceptively challenging world. I also don't think we're ever gonna get a witch from this technique. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Um, wow. Wow. We actually almost just burned to death. And in a nutshell, that's why I'm okay with losing our guy. Well, on the bright side, we got a whole bunch of iron. That means we can finally get this guy leveled up. Ooh, the axe? Sure, I'll buy some axes. Wow, those are expensive. What was I thinking? Ah, wheat, bread. Hey, here it is. Unbreaking and sharpness. That's actually not bad. Give me your boots and your pants and your helmet. Protection two and feather falling. Nice. Now, while we're on the topic of organization, I think it's time we start expanding the island. Tremendous. Now, as sad as it is, I must return to the wood chopping and cobblestone acquiring life. A few days later. Ladies and gentlemen, 
The time has come. We got all this cobblestone, all these trap doors. So we start with a nice base like so. Now we just need to go 22 blocks high. Next, we make our bridges. Our island's not looking too bad. Next up, we add a wall around the edges and once more around the top. Next, we add in floor, add another wall, water here, trap doors, plot twist. They're actually bars of chocolate. Okay, and now we fill in the ceiling. Perfect. Now we remove this. Torches go away. Oh, that's getting spooky. Trap doors go down. Now I'll just throw a bunch of torches up top. I'm also gonna chuck some cobblestone around just to maybe help prevent slimes from spawning. So I think we have this right. Except I'm an idiot and forgot to put the hoppers down first. Definitely works though. We have to be very careful. Chests and hoppers. Whoa, check out all these discs. Ha. So if we then make a sword. Whoa. Oh my God. Sick. So all we need to do now is wait for witches to come down and then we can hopefully get sugar. Now, finally, we can actually patch this up. So we have no more mobs spawning here. So now the only place that mobs can spawn is up here. Oh, there's a witch. The moment of truth. Redstone. No! Well, we'll keep trying. Oh, please! No! Oh, well, glass bottles. I will take that. Still disappointing, though. Well, I just realized it's day 50. Normally, this is where we'd stop, but, uh, you know what? Let's keep going. <gasps> please! Oh, potion of healing. I hear you! Please! One in eight chance! <gasps> yes! Haha! -ha! May have taken me three days, but that's right. We finally got sugar and actually bottles, which we also needed. It is time. Why, well, hello. So we're just a dude looking for a nether fortress. I don't want any trouble. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. Yes, I do. Wait. <laughs> okay, well, that was incredibly easy. Hello, nether wart. Oh, we do need mushrooms. Dude, this is the most unluckiest spawn ever. <gasps> I see one and I hear one. And that is a spotter. Oh, that is the spotter. What is this fortress, though? <sighs> food, 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 food. Woo! Ah! Yes. Ah! Run! Yes! Yes! I feel so powerful right now. I just fought 800 blades. Do you really think you're going to be a problem? Yeah, we're also looking for gold. Hey, you ready? 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 Come on. <laughs> you idiot. Damn. My man is taking a bath. Sorry, right, bro. Didn't mean to interrupt. Wait. Oh my god. You are in the nether. Well, well, well. Sure, I'll take some bread. I was truly worried. Ladies and gentlemen, the brewing stand. One fermented spider eye. Add some gunpowder. And there we have it. So the other thing we need to cure our villagers are golden apples. This is not enough gold. However, if we take our iron and make an anvil, we can then place said anvil down. Take all our fortune one pickaxes and just put them together. And there you have it, fortune three. We'll head back to the nether. And I guess we can just try some basic mining for gold. Oh, so spicy. Hey, there we go. Now we make two golden apples. Now my poor, poor zombie villagers. What did they do to you? What did I allow to happen to you? I just want to say I'm sorry. And if you're willing to accept my apology, then here you go. An apple. There, there's an apple. I recognize that this is going to be a challenging time for you. You've been zombified for twice as long as your entire existence. So I would understand if, if you don't really want to even turn back. But trust me, there are profits to be made. Tell you what, I'm even going to let you guys out because I'm low-key terrified that one of you are going to turn the other back. Buried in Minecraft? <gasps> yes! Now, my friend, it's your turn. Come to the light. Yes! Guys, we did it. You're back. And you, my, my weaponsmith. Oh, that's actually not a bad deal. All right, our dudes have made it in. So as far as turning villagers, I would say we're just getting started. And I think if anyone's gonna be next, it's gotta be the Fletchers. So here's the game plan. We have this container directly below them. And if we double it up and remove the torches around it, I'm hoping that's dark enough to have mobs spawn in. And eh, worst case, they'll spawn in that corner. We also need more golden apples. So I will buy one very expensive pickaxe. So now we just need to find some more gold or ancient debris. I am hacking. <laughs> hey. Hey. Well, single pieces it is, I guess. Oh, hey. 
Oh my god. When ancient debris is easier to find than gold. Hey. Okay, so a little over two stacks of gold and seven ancient debris. So we're gonna make 10 golden apples. We'll also smelt our ancient debris. Now we just need this zombie. There's a zombie. Now, oh, follow me, sir. So come on in. I would say that worked well and good enough. Now we're just gonna start breaking these and wait for our guys to fall in. Actually, we'll break it from this side. There we go. <laughs> this is so evil. He's like, no, please don't do it. I'm sorry. I need the emeralds. Now I'll just observe from a distance. <laughs> oh, well, well, well. You smell that? It smells like profits. Okay, now this is the part I'm not so sure about. <laughs> we'll splash potion everyone. There we go, they've all had their apple. Problem with this method is we then have to kind of keep these guys under control so they don't return each other. <gasps> oh, juke and jive, zombies pro. There's one, two, three, four. And there it is. I can't believe that actually worked. Now let's take this wood. Let's see what sort of deals we're looking at here. What do you got for me? 26, 26. 26 and 26. Wow, I gotta say, I'm uh, I've seen better, guys. I've seen a whole lot better. You know, that is still about 20% more efficient, so I'll I will take it, but I would love to see a better number than that. Oh, yeah, it is noticeably better. Oh, 25. Fortunately, we got more wood than that, and don't think I'm forgetting our other dude. 26 right off the hop. I think it actually might be cool to turn this downstairs area into a trading hall. Okay, well for now, something like this. And I actually want it to be like, I don't know, nice. So, so there, now it's, it's nice. <laughs> now I'd like to spend the rest of my diamonds on a new pair of pants and boots and a bunch of swords. Cause wow, that's actually a crazy deal. For now, this is really the only way to get sick upgrades. <laughs> But we can also do Feather Falling 3. And you know what? I'm breaking 2. Sure. But we've still got a lot of villagers that we need to get to master. Like this cleric. Fortunately, we have at least a bit of rotten flesh in here. Whoa! Unbreaking 3, Power 3 bow? Let's get that. And yeah, there's our flame. Yeah, that's not a bad looking bow. Anyway, let's see what we can do with our cleric. We can buy redstone and lapis. I will actually buy lapis. Oh, and we can get glowstone. I mean, it's expensive, but whatever. Yeah, there's ender pearls. And bam, there it is. The master cleric, done. Let's drop our last Fletcher down in here too. Haha. -ha. Guess now we'll just sell off the rest of our wood. Okay, not bad. This thing just, <laughs> it's just not working. So here's what we're gonna do. You ready? <laughs> that wasn't quite as fun as the last time. But come on in, cows. We're taking it old school. None of this stupid hopper system that just isn't working. Now, we've made some great progress with our villagers. So far, we have a master Fletcher, Shepherd, Cleric, Weaponsmith, Toolsmith, and Armorer. And with that said, there are still four work tables that we do not have and cannot make. So, we leave tomorrow morning. All right, and so now we ride. <gasps> Okay, that's actually one of the things we need. Cauldron, I'll take them all. So we're also looking for barrels, books, or lecterns, and a cartography table. But sadly, this village does not have what we're looking for either. Well, I'm just gonna head in this direction and hope for the best. Aha! Well, I would say this is really good timing. Maybe not good enough. Some torches down. Now, quickly, let's see what we got. I do love to see a bit of hay. <gasps> a book, yes! So we just need one more. That's gonna be about everything. You know what, I'm feeling risky. Let's give this a shot at night. All right, show me the money. Wow, this is going well. <gasps> Paper, that should be enough, I think. Wow, thank you. So now we just need barrels, I, which to be honest, I'm not even sure if they exist in planes. Okay, this is actually looking promising. <gasps> not just looking, that is a librarian. Now. Library. Where's the library? I will take cartography and I will take paper. You have bookshelves. That's what I need. Where is your, where is your lectern? How can there be a librarian with no library? Well, regardless, we got what we need. Well, one whole day later, finally, here's another village. 
Okay, more paper. More cartography. We need fishermen. And I don't know if we're gonna actually ever find them. <gasps> Please, diamonds. Saddle. Actually, that's huge. I can tame this horse. <gasps> yes. Now. <gasps> wow, we have a horse. I don't think I can really use them to get to other villages, but that's sick. Sadly, however, once again, there are no barrels. That might actually not be a problem. And that's because that's how you make a barrel. See, look at that, guys. We're learning something new every day. <laughs> okay, barrel, book, cartography table, and cauldron. What are the odds we could get two chickens back to the compound? This might actually work. Come on, my chickens. Yes. We've made it back to a familiar village. There is our house. Oh, come on. Ladies and gentlemen. Yes, we did it. You can just chill. Come on in. Yes. Ha ha. Now, that's just the side reward. Now, it's time for the main stuff. So, we got our cauldron, barrel, cartography table. Now, make one more book. Which then gives us a bookshelf. And there's our lectern. Oh yeah, and a smoker. So that should make everything. Ah, I was forgetting the numbers. Mason. Well, 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 look at the new crew. Who first? Butcher, because food is actually useful. <gasps> a cooked chicken? Oh my God, why didn't I do this sooner? Who needs rabbit stew anyway? Literally just give me all your chicken. Whoa, protection four. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that. We're on the way to an enchanting table. Well, let's see what another day of chopping trees will do. Apparently really not all that much. It's a slow hustle, but our butcher is restocked on chicken. And there it is. <laughs> the master butcher who still doesn't give us anything else. And look at all those chickens. I guess Mason will be next just because he's cheap. Hey, there we go. I'm realizing this is gonna take more time than I anticipated. So I'm probably just gonna take a few more days and uh, cut, cut, cut some trees. A few days later. For two days, I have done nothing but chop trees. So please, all I ask is you give me good deals because I, <laughs> I need the emeralds. Please, sirs. Mason. Ooh. He got that lime glazed terracotta though. It was all worth it. And congratulations on your master status. I think that gives us five trades left to go. Next, let's do our fishermen with buckets of cod. Cool. Yeah, sure. Do they uh, do they swim in here? <gasps> yes, they actually. Oh, okay. Okay, cool. We'll just make little huts for our dudes. Oh, and now he just got really expensive. Well, gonna need these cod. Eh, that's not bad. I suppose we could also check on our iron farm. It has literally been like 10 days. Now that is what you love to see. Oh my God. Gonna have to start trading iron. I didn't realize I've got all these emeralds in here. Start working on this librarian. That was easy. You'll sell me glass? Why didn't I think of this? There's no way to get sand in this game. Check it out. Now we can make glass bottles. Dang, that is huge. And our man's got more. It is weird that he sells the thing he also buys. Well, I suppose it could be worse. Because that makes 28 cod, which we can then sell off. Oh, and now he's got something that's a little bit more affordable. Wait, if I buy bookshelves... I can then break the bookshelves. And you'll actually give me Feather Falling, which I will take. The master librarian who has name tags. I want to buy them, but I got to save my emeralds. What I will do though is take these Feather Fallings and some more Feather Fallings and the Feather Falling Feather Fallings and make a Feather Falling Feather Falling Feather Falling. We'll then take that book, add it to our pre-existing Feather Falling and now we have Feather Falling 4. Now we still gotta deal with this farmer who shouldn't be a huge problem. Let's just buy some cookies. Oh my God, easy enough. And wow, suspicious stew. Farmers are so easy. And there it is. Now we get golden carrots. So cookies are like really trash, huh? They don't even give saturation. All right, you listen here there, fisherman. Gosh dang it, he's already out. Well, we should also get a start on this leather worker. I don't need these. Ah, but that is a much better deal. I still don't need them. And I guess it'll be caps. I really don't need these. Wow, iron actually is coming in clutch. Weird, 
but look at that. It's so easy. And ladies and gentlemen, our master leather worker. Oh, he actually gives us saddles. That's pretty cool. But I don't need anything. Someone who was once my friend, now looking like an arch nemesis, the cartographer. Sir, I will return. All right, this has got to be it. We got over 100 emeralds. Show me cartographer. We got one, two, three, four, five, six empty maps. Oh no. Wait, I got an idea. We could buy glass from the librarian, turn the glass into panes. Now, oh, bro, it's just like we're back in the desert, you legend. I guess we gotta do more of that, which means we'll buy more glass panes. And there it is, that easy. Oh, next up, banners, bro. Come on, give me all your banners. And there it is a master cartographer. But you know what's not so easy? It's this stupid fisherman. You're the last guy. And the only thing is gonna be fishing rods. Okay, we'll just sell some iron. All oh, right, it's not even enough. I hate you so much. You're so useless. You don't give anything good either. The hardest level up has the worst things. More fish. All right, better be iron. Oh, dear God. You win today, sir. <gasps> More sugar. Thank you, tower gods. Wow. I think this is it. Still 29, but I don't care. Ugh. Gosh, dude, wh how? You don't even sell fish. It's right there. <gasps> oh my God, that's more sugar. Bro, how? <laughs> I just threw my good bow into the fire. Well, that is sadness with 38 emeralds as our final purchase. Ladies and gentlemen, there he is in all his glory, the master fisherman who takes boats for one emerald. How easy would that have been? Sir, I hate you, but ladies and gentlemen, I'm excited to say this entire place is a mess. We have done one of our goals, which is master every single type of villager in the game. Now, I need to persuade some of these villagers to become librarians. Smite five, looting three, and of course, the mending. Now, I'm gonna do the unthinkable, and I'm gonna break these bookshelves in front of these lads, because now they'll give me trades. Wow. <laughs> Mending is so expensive. Ha, ah, but so worth it. Also gonna buy a protection four. So protection four goes on the diamond chest plate. And then of course, the mending. Protection three and mending. Actually one more protection four, which we add to the boots. And then mending on top of that. I can't say I'm in love with blast protection, so I might just hold off with that for now. But all things considered, we finally got a decent pair of armor. And... Finally, one netherite ingot, which gives us our very own netherite chest plate. Puts us one quarter of the way there. Now I just need to procure a few more emeralds. And now we can buy some beds. Oh, you know what we're about to do. It's time to finally start working on the rest of this netherite set. Oh, here we go. Ah, <laughs> oh, hey, that was easy. Take it the rest of this is not gonna be as easy. Oh my god. Dude, I am literally hacking. Just find out the luckiest single pieces. Well, let's continue. Oh my god. The luckiest session ever. <gasps> yes. Hey. Thought I saw something over here. Well, six ancient debris for one inventory of beds. I'll take that. Do it. <gasps> yes. Welcome to the light, my dude. So, one more ingot. That'll go on our leggings. And we even got enough for one more. Wow. That was shockingly easy. So with 61 more emeralds. Yeah, that should be enough. Back to the mines. Hi there. How you doing? <gasps> and how you doing? Hey, how are you? Me, yeah, I'm doing pretty good. Really good. Oh, me just uh, mining some ancient debris. No big deal. Okay, one day later, we're back. Bro, two netherite ingots. I want protection and smite and a diamond sword. Yeah, diamond sword. <laughs> so we got to grindstone both of these. But then we add smite and mending. And here we add protection and mending. Last but not least, we add the netherite. And again, woo, that feels good. That just, you know, in a world made entirely of lava, netherite gear just feels right. Ha, what's up losers? Oh my God. Now, you, sir, we've uh, we've got some work to do. So I think everyone just kind of fell down here when I tried to get a single villager. 
I got efficiency five, and I actually kind of like that. But now we have to try with a brand new villager. <gasps> Looting one is not great, but we can make that work. Oh, we still got some homies up here. So I'll just break another bookshelf by one, two, three, four lootings. Gosh, I really should just make this one giant thing. And looting two, looting two, makes looting three, which I can't afford. Ha, just kidding. Yes, I can. Ah, just crouch shift, bro. Wow, I gotta be honest. I think this actually looks really cool. I think we should finish our marketplace. <gasps> the cat. <laughs> All right, you didn't see that. Bro, you don't even have a job. You don't get a bed. Well, it's a start for now. Sir, please give me a mending. So finally, mending pick. I don't know why, but this jumping makes me so anxious. We're just gonna put a stop to that. There you go, buddy. Absolutely no jumping. Uh, you go right on in there. There you go. That certainly makes things easy. And our cleric and fisherman. You stupid, stupid fisherman. Ha ha! Now, let's just make this a little bit wider. Oh, we just seal these last guys off. These neutral workers. Ladies and gentlemen, we're done. The finishing touch. There you go, good sir. Actually, just one final switch up. That goes there. Wake up. You go here. And then we have the potential for another armorer. And then the mason, who I don't really care about, can be over there. Of course, there's one. Go down the hole. Yes. <laughs> now just come on. Yes. Woohoo! We did it. You know what? I don't mind a few jumpers. It's kind of exciting. No, I'm just kidding. So we need leather. Sticks. And now we have item frames. Weapon. Armor. And tool. Leather. Cod. Yeah. Chicken, of course. And glistening melon. Wow. This is so cool. We'll triple up on the books. This guy has to be a bed. And then lastly, one piece of paper and chiseled stone brick for the mace. Okay, well, I'm gonna chop some more trees and sticks. More beds and beds. And back to the nether we go. I have a bad feeling this might take longer than last time. Let the games begin. And begin they shall. Okay, I think that should be it. It's time consuming, but definitely gets easier once you get the hang of it. Also, I can now one-shot skeletons. Well, if we want more netherite tools, we're gonna need some levels. I think that should do it. And some emeralds. Also need some books. And one, two, three mendings. Ah, uh, sadly, we're gonna need more diamonds. One day later. Efficiency two and efficiency two. And then a pretty solid axe buy three of those three shovels sadly there are no hoes but we can add these together and we can add these together for an efficiency four shovel add these picks together make a new anvil add the three and the three to get the four and we'll do the same with axes <laughs> one second to get efficiency four with unbreaking three. And now we'll spend the rest of the night deleting trees. Oh boy, emeralds. Oh boy, more tools. Wow, that was expensive. Aw, two and two makes three. Two and three makes four. And four and four makes five. Get a little netherite on the go. And there's the pick. Ah, oh, this is so much easier if you just keep it at low levels. And just like that, an efficiency five shovel and our very own efficiency five axe. More chubby chop. The diamond mending shovel, make that netherite. A little more choppy chop. The mending axe and the netherite efficiency four unbreaking three mending axe. Ha, <sighs> it's gonna be really hard to get a hoe. Ooh, all sorts of stuff in here, but we're not quite done. So we're looking for enchanted bows. So we can take this power two and this power two and add them together and then add that to ours. Yeah, this really isn't going all that well. However, we can get unbreaking one and ooh, power two, power three, power four, and power five. A little slicey slicey. There's our unbreaking three. And hey, that's a pretty good bow. What's up, nerd? Ha, what's up, nerds? 
<laughs> biggest nerd of them all. <laughs> and I gotta say, all things considered, we're actually pretty cracked. I did not think we were gonna be able to make it this far, but we're not done yet. No, that's right, chickens. And that's right, cows. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think it's time. We've got the gear. Now we just need the wither skeleton skulls. Well, through the magic of editing, that looked incredibly easy. It wasn't. Oh, hey, there's something we need up there. We need this or this. So I think we make a fishing rod. <gasps> yes, warp fungus on a stick. Okay, I've got, I've got a plan. And it does not involve burning in lava. I don't have a saddle with me. And you need a saddle, don't you? Hey, buddy. Need this for just a sec. <laughs> what, what is going on? Hey, guys. <gasps> That's so cool. Just follow me. <laughs> I give you mushroom. Oh. <gasps> no, you get off him. This is my ride. Yes, we did it. I'll just... <laughs> these guys, these guys go up. Oh, oh, ah, 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 ah. oh, 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 buddy, 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 buddy. Yes, come on, come on, come on. Yes, oh, oh, oh my God. What? How? How? Oh my God. Just go up right there. Yeah, there we go. That was something. Everything is fine. That's why we have netherite armor. Yes! Huge success! <laughs> Finally, ladies and gentlemen, check this out! <gasps> oh my god, we have a strider on the overworld! Woo! I will be right back. I need a name tag! Hot lad! Come back, hot lad! I name thee Hot Lad! And there is a pool for you to chill in. All right, so we've got everything we need for our fight. Seeing as we have a week, I think we should probably do some more updates to the land. So let's tear down this ugly wall first and foremost. And now we can start expanding. Excellent. I'm not going to forget to torch it up this time. Oh, how I missed efficiency. And the work can continue. Yeah, not bad. And last side. Yeah. I like that a lot. Everything was starting to feel a little cramped. And for now, I think I'd like to add a little finishing touch. More trees. Anyway, back to the perimeter. Tremendous. Yeah, I think this looks like a really nice perimeter. Oh no. Oh, why? Oh, hot boy, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. All right, maybe if we make a little shelter, perhaps this will be enough. You know, it's really so sad because we lost the saddle. Well, with the few days that remain, I think I would really like to try to find some diamonds. Wow, check out this throwback. Our spawn village. Dude, there's actually villagers still alive here. We're gonna head off from the point where it all began. Man, this would have been so much easier with the strider. What a disappointment. On to the next one. Oh no, it's another L and another L. Please, you know, I, I don't even feel bad that you guys are on fire. Oh my God. Oh, please, please, please. Dear Minecraft gods, this has got to be at least the sixth chest of a weaponsmith we have opened. Let's go. Three. Yes. Look at that. 97 days. We got diamonds. Okay. I am way too excited. This is dangerous. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. You can jive. You can jive. The spawns are better up here. It's almost daytime. I just remembered something else. Check out these pigs, but not just these pigs. No, no, no. You guys remember this? Bro, all the way back on like day one, we trapped these dudes in here and I promised I would return. And now all these days later, I will lead the pigs back home. All right, yeah, slimes, just go ahead. Bounce on into that lava. There you go. There's one village cleared. Excellent formation, lads. Wow, I am master of pigs. Oh my God. Ah. <laughs> That was so cool. Wow, look at that. Oh no, we lost a pig. Oh no, 
you're gonna be okay. We've watched it in the final minute. But ladies and gentlemen, we have pigs. There you go, little winkers. Hi! More importantly, we have three diamonds. Now, this is gonna be the most controversial thing I do on video. I should make an enchanting table. The thing is, dude, I've got all the enchantments I need. And if there's anything else I need, I can just get more librarians. Okay, day 98, I have a mission. You, sir, I need a diamond hoe. That is not a diamond hoe. Take the job. <laughs> Why not? No, dude, I only have one day left. No. <laughs> okay, I'll be back. I don't have enough time. Get the iron, make some blocks, grab our other blocks. Beacon is going right here. Tremendous. Why won't you take your job? Okay, yes. Now, please, sir. Diamond Ho. No, please. No. I am devastated. There's not enough time. I hate that I have to do this. I really wanted an enchanting table. Not that we need it, but there it is. The Diamond Ho. Take our mending. And ladies and gentlemen, there it is. The absolute audacity. Okay, so that's everything netherite. Now. Let's go kill ourselves a wither. Okay, apples, ender pearls, sure. Potion of healing, sure. Wow, this is gonna be a tough fight. I don't have a lot of potions. Oh, sun, we gotta do this before the sun's down and it is going down. Okay, we gotta get away from the house. And now we just make a massive area. Ah! Oh, we don't even like have time to think right now. Ah, I don't need a hoe, I don't need a shovel. Oh, I feel like this is a bad idea. Here we go. Okay, okay. Just instant apple. Oh, come on. Okay, yes, this is going well. This is going well. This is going well. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come down to me. Come down to me. I need you. I need you. You're almost there. Yes. Get a little bit of this smite. A little bit of this smite. What's up? What's up? Woo! Woo! Come on. Come on. Yes! Okay. 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 <laughs> and now it's getting dark. Oh, where am I going? Where am I going? Where am I going? Oh, oh no! Oh my god! Oh my god! I timed that close! Ah! Oh wow! Dude, 15 more seconds! We would have died! Dumbest thing I've ever done? You be the judge! But ladies and gentlemen, there it is! The Iron Beacon! For me, this is a first. So speed and jumping won't really help us. I think the best play would be resistance and regeneration. Because honestly, this has been a really dangerous run. And I feel a little bit safer knowing I always have regeneration. Well guys, considering everything, I gotta say, I look at this as a huge success. Might not be the most fancy plot of land, but considering we started in a world made of nothing but lava, I'm impressed. And honestly, I think this is our crowning achievement. So that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Also, we are getting super close to 1 million subscribers, so if you could please hit that button to help us out, that would be amazing. Thank you guys again, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace!